Hello subscribers, I'm back with another video. Now this video is a little bit different than my usual videos. Um, I'm actually making a Premiere Pro tutorial, as you can see here. And so this tutorial is really just about how to um, make the image rotate, and any image rotate, how to make any image uh, zoom in and out, how to make it uh, move from place to place. So um, I got two images here right now with me. I got a this white image right here and this baby image. Um, so I'm gonna do what I'm gonna show you guys is how to create keyframes and how to actually make this baby picture um, move in this um, white background here. So I'm gonna go ahead, put this white background in my sequence as, as well as as well as this one. All right, now I got both of them together as you can see here. Let me just uh, zoom this in. So I got play button click on here then make sure you're in effect controls and um, you click this little thing right here and you can zoom in you can zoom out you can rotate you can uh, what's the other thing oh yeah um, position it you can move it around obviously sorry for the lag there but um yeah what you want to do is um, is move it around so Let's say I want the baby picture to start right here and then at my bottom right corner of the screen. So what I want to do is make sure your marker thing here is at the very beginning of whatever you're, you're, you want to move. So when it's at the beginning, make sure it's also um, where you want it to be at the beginning. So I want it at the top left corner right now and then I'll have it move to the bottom right corner here. So I'm going to go ahead and um, what you want to do is, of course, make sure the first you're at the beginning of whatever you want to move. And you are going to click this little keyframe here, toggle animation, it says. And now you've done that, um, what you want to do is, I'm pretty sure you can press the bottom arrow key. Yeah, once you're at the bottom arrow key, um, you get this black screen. That's just because you're at, right at the end. You're the, at the frame right after the end, so you're just gonna press the left arrow key once and you got your image back. So now, this is the end of it, and obviously, you want your image down here. And as you can see, when you're moving it, you actually got this line here that's created. That's, that's where the image goes through. That's the path of the image. So if we play this through, let's see if my computer's not too laggy, you could see the image, the, oh, whoop. Don't worry about that. You see, you see the image goes down progressively as time goes on. So that's exactly what you want. Now I'm going to show you um, uh, scale. It's zooming in and out. So real quick, I'm gonna take away this uh, movement here. So for the scale, um, you just um, do this similar thing. You keep it at the beginning and you choose your beginning um, uh, scale, so I'm gonna have it relatively big here. I'm gonna set the keyframe, put it to 10% so I can reach it here. Um, now I'm gonna go to the end by pressing the bottom arrow key. No, oh, you gotta make sure you're in a sequence, my bad. Bottom arrow key at the end, press the left arrow key to get back into your image here. And you're gonna set the last keyframe. And there we go. So now let's see. I got my image here that's zooming out. Let's see if it works. There, whoops. Yep, it's fine. There we go. Baby zooming out. So that's great. That works. So the last thing I'm going to show you is the rotation um, of the image if you want to do that. So, um,. Yeah, so say I want my image to spin around from uh, this first frame here to the last one. So what I'm going to do is um, start out, uh, of course, all the time uh, at the beginning. And then what I'm going to do is, real quick, I'm going to delete this, uh, these keyframes here. Um, what I want to do is click this uh, toggle animation button. Um, of course, I'm going to double click on the image and start the the, the the beginning frame, sorry I can't speak today, do the same thing, bottom arrow key, 
Nope, gotta go back on the sequence, my bad. Bottom arrow key, whoops, bottom arrow key, left arrow key, and now um, I'm gonna put my last keyframe, my last frame I want my image to look at. Look at. So I'm gonna go full 180 degrees. And normally I should have rotated a full 180 degrees. Let's see. Again, sorry for that lag. It's not the image, it's just my computer. Um, so yeah, as you can see, it worked. It uh, flipped upside down. So now also, what you can do, now that you learn, learned all these three, you can, um, well, put, pull all of them together. So I've got your position, scale, and rotation. So I'm just going to go make my image go all over the place. I'm going to go scale down here, and bring it back up, rotate a little bit. No, actually, yeah, and that's the beginning. So that's how the beginnings look like. And so right here, I'm going to teach you something else. If you go through the the your image, through your sequence here, you can actually change the um, different things here according to where you are. So it's kind of hard to explain here. But if I go um, two, uh, one third through the, the sequence here, then I could go over here, make a little bit smaller, and then I can go uh, Two thirds into the sequence, and I can uh, I can bring it down here. As you can see, it's starting to make a line here. Right here was when the the cursor was right there. <coughs> make this a little bit bigger, and at the end, when it is right here. So now I made a nice zigzag. I'm gonna rotate a little bit more. And uh, yeah, I'm not exactly at the last frame here, but it should be okay. Uh, and uh, yeah, let's see how it ends up. Oh, okay, don't mind the lag, please. And now you can see it does exactly as I asked it to. So that's pretty much it. I'm probably gonna make a more in-depth video about this if you guys like me like me too. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment down below asking me whatever you need and um, that's pretty much it and that is how to scale position and rotate your image throughout the, um, the sequence to make it move